We hope to help stabilize people. Hello, I'm ji Kim, a CEO of Dorbom Dream, who develops hyper-personalization smart care clothing, Huggy. As we become an aging society, the number of targets for care is increasing rapidly. Due to the rapid aging and increasing disabled population, the demand for care is increasing, but there is a lack of manpower to provide care. As a result, the importance of care technology is increasing. So we analyze which factors are the main causes of high dependence on human resources. First, people who need care have anxiety, depression, and high stress in their daily lives. And communication is difficult because they can't express their intention. Also, despite the spread of smartwatch, there was a problem that often disappeared. So we solved each of these problems. First, the, the vest automatically operates to relieve stress and depression. It will give stable through air pressure. Secondly, we can monitor the emotional state of users who can't express their intention in real time through the application. Lastly, it would like to relieve their worries by allowing them to check the current location with the vest usually wear. So this huggy an innovative smart vest that will integrate all these solutions to lead care technology. What we are paying attention to is deep touch pressure. Appropriate pressure on the body of person stimulates parasympathetic nerves and gives them a sense of stability. So huggy is a vest that shows stress and emotional conditions of people with developmental disabilities based on heart rate and EDA and operates automatically. The autism market consists of private institutions, national and public treatment education institutions, and families with autism. We have a strength to enter a developmental disabilities institution first, secure reliability and awareness, and then move toward a family with autism. So we have made efforts to maintain relationship with institution and SK Happiness Foundation signed a donation project agreement. And in case of Venture Nara, which is a government in Korea, registration is completed through institutional recommendation. So many treatment and education institutions have also expressed their intention to introduce and purchase products. As a result of the test to prove the effect, the average concentration of classes increased by 28% when wearing vest. And after analyzing the concentration of cortisol in saliva, the stress decreased 50 by 57%. In addition, we were able to confirm the possibility of huggy from the review of the occupational therapist who said that the actual effect was very good. So you can see the difference in the video before and after wearing the vest. Also, after completing preparation as an assistant device for the disabled for a year and four months, it was finally selected as a public payroll item registration and received $130 in government support for each product. Although several types of inflatable vests exist before, but it was either too heavy or too expensive. There was no vest anywhere that monitors automatic operation and user state. In the case of Canada, an only overseas entry market, government subsidies are provided to all income groups with autism and children who have recently suffocated due to weighted vest. Accordingly, a local Canadian team member confirmed a very positive response from occupational therapist. In addition, we successfully completed Japanese crowdfunding and completed trademark application and CPC certification for Amazon entry. We are currently in full-scale sales starting with sales generated and we will maximize sales through connection with overseas sales and other services. We are the best team to produce and sell vest more than anyone else including our excellent development team consisting of SNU and KAIST, fashion designers, sales and marketers, and market researchers in Canada, and occupational therapists who treat children with autism in the real fields. 
For those who need care in the world, Dorbom Dream, we will continue to be with you until the end. Thank you for listening.